What's up guys? I'm at SHOT Show. I stopped by the B&T booth down on the first floor. I was here before, but they have some updates. Check this out. So this is the GHM-9. It's like a sub gun. And uh, what's new with this one is that it has a tail hook, collapsible buttstock on there. So it's an SBR. But actually, no, it's not an SBR. It's a pistol. So this is a really cool looking pistol. You don't need to have any special uh, attack stamps. I mean, other than the suppressor, of course. But if you took that suppressor off, you could have this pistol in this exact uh, format with this tail hook uh, brace, basically. Really cool. And then here is the SBR version with an actual folding buttstock. That's pretty sweet looking. And that's what it looks like when it's folded. As you can see, it's um, pretty compact. Pretty compact. Bit heavy bit big for a pistol but fantastic when it comes to shooting because that weight absorbs a lot of that weak core I'm sure all right so over here you got the APC 45 and this is actually a pistol as well even though it's suppressed uh, you wouldn't need any special tax stamps for this either if you didn't have that on there but yeah 45 ACP pistol with the folding uh, brace there Pretty sweet. You got the 45 man stopper. It looks pretty sexy with that suppressor on there. And there's another one with a little bit smaller suppressor. BNT actually specializes in suppressors as well. I believe they make parts for HK now. So here's the APC 223. So that's your civilian legal rifle, basically. This is the one that we probably see at gun stores. They're, they're pretty simple. You walk in, you buy it. Folding buttstock, 16 inch barrel. Pretty sweet, man. It's, it's all the same that we've seen before, but that's just the civilian model, 16-inch barrel, pretty sexy. And then they have a couple pimped-out models. These are like the really cool ones. Here's the SBR with some crazy flash cam, like blast deflector kind of thing on the front. Again, chambered in 223. Here's one with that uh, collapsing buttstock. This is a new thing uh, I'm starting to see now. Instead of having a rod. They have these flat, these flat pieces of metal instead to, I guess, make it a little bit more compact. Pretty cool. There's another SBR down there. But the, actually, it's not an SBR. This is a pistol. And then check this out. This is the MP9 or the TP9 9 millimeter. Look at that. That is sweet. This has been around a long, long time. I remember seeing this probably 15 years ago. But uh, back again, but made by BNT. I think it was, I forgot who made these before. It might have been Steyr or somebody. That's a cool little uh, pistol, though. I guess in America, this would be a SBR because of the buttstock. But in general, without that, it would be a pretty, pretty cool little pistol, right? like a machine pistol. Matter of fact, here's the pistol right here. So, looks like a little machine pistol, right? Pretty cool. And, oh, I forgot to mention, um, the APC, the new one now, is coming in 300 blackout. So if you want that heavy uh, hitting round, you can get it in 300 blackout. Pretty sweet. So check this out. This is the USW. So essentially it's a pistol, but here in America this would be an SBR. Look at that brace on there. And BNT is known for making uh, suppressors. It's actually marked, marked HK because they're an OEM producer for HK. Pretty sweet. Check this thing out. So this is a, they call this a VP9, which is uh, interesting, but um, it very much resembles that old World War II, I think it was called the Liberator. It's a little cheap gun they used to um, assassinate bad guys, and then you would throw it away. This is uh, basically uh, similar to that. So single shot, you would actually unscrew this back here, and then open the bolt to load another round, and then close it and, and screw it back down, and then uh, shoot it. I think there's a couple rounds in here, probably like five rounds in here, I think. But uh, yeah, pretty cool, suppressed. Oh, it even has a little um, 
like a gas seal there to help reduce the sound. So you shoot through that rubber piece there. Really? But, uh, yeah. Cool little spy gun if you're a spy or an assassin. Really? Pretty sweet, right?